Hello everyone, this is Rich A from WindowsObserver.com. Just wanted to show you something that I've discovered as I've been testing Windows 8.1 RTM. And actually I saw this same behavior in Windows 8.1 Preview. And in fact, when I first saw it in the preview, I thought it was a bug of some type. And what was happening was if I had two modern apps snapped on a single screen, and I went to the start screen and opened up a third modern app, it kind of placed itself over the screen in a very strange way and I just attributed it to a bug. I think I posted a couple snapshots of it, screenshots of it, but never heard anything back from everybody. I've done, I've, I've researched, I can't find anybody talking about this as a feature or anything like that or even finding it. So I'm not sure if this may be undocumented, but now that I'm in 8.1 RTM testing, I'm, I'm more convinced that this is actually a UI feature that just hasn't been talked about as opposed to a bug of some type. Um, so let me show you what I've been dis what I discovered and, and show you how it works. So what you see here on the screen is I have two modern apps open side by side with the 50-50 split of the screen space. On the left hand side is NG Reader, that's the program I use to read my RSS feeds, and on the right hand side is the Windows Store. So if I go down to the lower left hand corner and I click to the start screen and I open a third modern app and for this one I'll do Internet Explorer. What you'll notice is it kind of overlays itself on top of the screen and then it winks, what I call wink and it kind of, I think it might be giving me a visual clue as to how to use it. You can also see where the two other modern apps have been kind of broken out from the locked in half and half of the screen. So if you also move your mouse, you also create that little winking motion and you can see how it it kind of brings one side or the other to the forefront. So if I if I click on the left hand side of this screen, it puts that modern app into the left hand uh, side of the screen's real estate uh, screen real estate and it comes up for use. And of course if I click, I switch out with that with the other modern app. Now if I go back again to the start menu and I pick another modern app, let's say the Adobe Photoshop Express app, it does the same exact thing. You'll see it wink and then if I choose to go to the to the right hand side it fills in over there and then you're still able to switch between the apps on the active side. So I'm not sure if this is documented. I haven't seen anything. If anybody has seen anything please comment on the video or the story and let me know where you saw it so I can go look at the resource for it. But up to this point I haven't been able to find anything in my research for it. So I, I suspect that this is just an undocumented UI feature uh, to help you when you're multitasking with modern apps. I, I like the behavior, I like the way it works, and it, this will work on the screen even if it's not 50-50. If it's one-third and two-thirds, it will still do the same type of behavior until you click on it and stick it in one of the slots where the modern apps are. So, uh, we'll catch you next time. This is Rich Hay from WindowsObserver.com.